Welcome to our YouTube channel. My name is Asmi. And I'm Roger. And, and welcome, welcome to Roger and Asmi Vlogs. So for today's topic, Filipinas' reaction to backdoor. Ooh. Okay. Wow. So before we start, maraming salamat sa yung suporta o paghigugma sa among channel. Thank you so much for your support and love, guys. And if you're new to this channel, don't forget to hit the subscribe, like, and share button. And click the notification bell for new uploads or new videos. Okay, so now for sure, they're excited to hear us and listen what are the uh, reactions. I know, guys, because some, maybe some of you sometimes do that to your woman. Some of you prefer or like it, right? <laughs> yeah, so uh, we're making this video for um, our viewers to know because there are some uh, subscribers that are willing to know what... Um, our like reaction not only Filipinas but also uh, uh, Filipinos so right now we're making this video for you to uh, know what are those so let's go ahead and start now yeah so as you all know guys what do Filipinas think about that so of course we um, put in some points mm -hmm. yeah so first is disgusting yes that's our um, reaction. Even um, me, or a, as a Filipino, that's my first uh, reaction also. Like uh, being disgusting or gross. Um, how much more to a Filipina, right? So yes. what about you? For me, of course, it's disgusting because that's the only like hole that you release your dirt right your poop everything that you release what you eat and then you will use it for what else so i think that's already dirty and not only that it's stinky every every germs is in there so you would really think that how about using a condom but still you would really find it disgusting and you would say, ah, oh, you can definitely find ways as me to clean it up. Still, it's disgusting. Because um, large intestines, <laughs> intestines, you would think about intestine. You're going, you put your thing there. And you would try to, what, feel something. Yeah, it's really gross for me. Like, I can't imagine... If I would be a guy, I can't imagine putting my thing there, even though I would be using a condom. Yes, I totally agree with that. Because also, one of the reasons is not common. And for sure, we Filipinos are not used to it, right? And I often hear these answers from... Uh, uh, Filipinas that why you should go to uh, the second hole which is uh, I have my first hole something like that they have that that question yeah of course but how about you are you curious you actually shared to our viewers before that you were curious right yeah I'm curious and uh, I'm like willing to try Willing to try, but you say you dis you're d you think that it's disgusting. Yes, um, as a person, as a human being, so we are curious. Even though it's not good or it's bad, but we have that in our mind, just to know what the the feeling is. Okay, so what is the feeling? I, I'm willing to try. I never tried it yet. Ah, okay. So you never tried it yet. So you didn't continue when she said, ouch. Yeah. Ah, okay. I thought that they really continued. So next is immoral. Immoral. So from the word immoral, 
Meaning to say, you're like treating someone like an animal or not a person. Yeah, because for me, there is the basic way or things that you can definitely just do in terms of having sex or making love, which is doing it in a proper way. Why would you use a hole that is function to discharge your dirt? right yes and uh, if we're going to base in uh let's say for example christian teaching or roman catholic um that would be really uh i could say contradict it's a big no to to us as um a christian yeah i would say so too <laughs> so I would definitely be offended if a guy would ask me, can I use your back door? Definitely no. I would not. I would not even try to have sex with you if you're that type of guy. Yeah, but as a human being, we have this kind of uh, curiosity, right? So we're not perfect. So we have that question in our mind, what if? like i should try this something like that uh well you can really avoid but um as we mentioned the reaction of filipinas is you're just being you know um like you disrespect or what you're filipina i would say like it's like this um if you try to persuade your filipina by doing it even even if we poop if we poop like um if our stool would be hard we cry how much more if it's bigger than our poop that will go inside i, I cannot imagine that i would definitely say that it's really painful even though i never tried it because even for me i I even shout mama, my mom, I call my mom if I, when I was a kid, if I have a, like a hard stool or like a, a hard discharge, my poop, I would really cry. How much more would that type of, like type of thing going in and out? So, I no, I cannot, I cannot do that. Um, next is you're not satisfied. So for me, if you want to, it, I know you guys are curious. I know guys, some, some of you really already, or you already tried it with the previous woman that you met or you have a relationship with. Maybe you are really adventurous of that type of sex, but, um, if you're not satisfied with the primary hole, you should just ask your partner do exercise to tighten it up. Yes. So, uh, if you are like uh, the type of person which is uh, curious about the thing, so for sure you have that in mind, and uh, to the point that you have to ask your partner, well, I would say both of you, you should like agree, like, you know, your, your partner, your, your wife, let's say, for example, your Filipina girlfriend should agree that, okay, um, I can do it. Something like that. You have to really ask her, ask her permission that, okay, for being curious, um, is it okay to do this? Or if you're curious also. Is it okay for you to experience this? Like both parties agree. Yeah. So much better to have like communication also. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Maybe your Filipina is adventurous or she could tolerate the pain. Yeah. That's for her. But for me, nah. I, I don't want to I agonize myself, especially after doing it. And you want to go to the comfort room and then you find out there's blood or blah, blah, blah. Uh, no. But, you know, there are some uh, Filipinas, but maybe few, few Filipinas that um, they're being curious to experience. And they have that question, not just being aggressive or what, but 
uh, there are a few Filipinas that they want to experience. Okay. So, okay. They're curious. Yeah, that's just up to them. <laughs> Next and the last is dignity. Yes, I would say dignity is you, like I said earlier also, I mentioned that you uh, disrespect her. That would be the, the like, common reaction for Filipinas if, yes. you, if they can hear or ask. Even though if you ask her personally and, you know, for sure her answer would be you disrespect the, the woman. You're, you're treating like an animal, not a person. You're treating her like a whore or a prostitute or a woman that you're just not treating her as your partner. Because for me, if you're already satisfied with the primary hole, why are you using the secondary hole? Just act for curiosity. Yeah, maybe. Think twice. Think twice, dude. Because for me, if you're a guy that respects your woman, you will not even ask that well yeah but out of curiosity because like as earlier million times that um human as we are so you you have that um your question and How's it emotion or feelings that oh how was it how's the the feeling afterwards but well um once again if you will ask filipinas what would be their reaction their reaction is really um negative towards this object yes true guys so um just be careful if you really want to be a stuntman or you were really want to gamble your relationship and you really want to experience that uh you can just just ask politely out, out, out of the curiosity if you really want to experience that with your Filipina. Yeah, once again, it really depends on you. If you are, let's say, for example, you are in a long, rela in a long relationship for, for how many years, for example, and then you're comfortable with each other. And if you agree both, so yeah, you can, you can try, but still it really depends on you guys. Yeah, true. So thank you so much, guys, for watching till the end. And I hope to see you in our next vlog. Bye. Bye.